Hi, my name is Kirk. Welcome to my little shop. Um, something I want to show everybody today um, is a video or little pictures on how I basically took my one horsepower Shop Fox single stage dust collection system and made a two stage dust collection system out of it by using the Oneida Air System 4 inch Super Dust Deputy Deluxe. This unit is this cyclone here and a 15 gallon bucket down here. Um, you can buy them on Amazon for $222. Yes, that's very steep, but actually it works really good and I'm really happy about it. It's different than all the other videos I saw on YouTube because the bottom of the cyclone comes out on a flange. Later in the video, I'll show some still pictures of it. Um, and, and in order to be able to dump this, um, they had to be able to separate somehow. They come with a clamp that you clamp this and the cyclone together, but I made it separate so they're all three on different levels. Um, you can see how well it works. That's from doing a little planing this morning um, and not hardly anything in here, but I'm really happy with it. So you got the 15 gallon bucket. I went ahead and put some uh, pipe insulation on the top of this. And then you can see down here where I put these little slants down here. And basically, I just put that in, slide it up, and then lift it up, and put that in there. And believe it or not, especially when that's empty, the suction sucks it up. And then when it turns off, you can hear it drop. But with a weight in there, it just holds it nice and tight. Uh, I don't have a CFM meter, but I have a uh, air velocity. Uh, coming out of the motor, I have about 44 miles per hour. Um, the old system, when it came out of a 90, would drop it down to about 35, 32 pounds. The way I have it set up now, at the end of my hose, two hoses, I have 40 or 42 pounds at both ends, so much more pressure. I um, just wanted to show you the valves on it. I went ahead and put two valves, one that comes up and over and down, and then connects to my vacuum, or my sump. Uh, table saw, which I can also take off and hook up with my attachments to do sanding and things like that. Um, the other one, I can close this valve, open this one, comes over here, goes to my band saw, and, or on my plane or wherever I want it to go. So, uh, it's pretty handy for a small shop. Uh, I'm real happy with it. It works really, really good. Uh, before I did this, I bought two different hoses because they were laying on the ground and I kept standing on them and cracking them. So, a good investment. Overall, I think this was like $200. That was $222, so I probably have $500 in it, but it's compact. It's on wheels. I can move it around if I need to. Uh, I'm very happy with it. This is the bottom of the cyclone. You can see the concave portion of it. First thing I did was build the foundation. For the unit. I cut a piece of board to put on the bottom of the 15 gallon barrel uh, to prevent the wedges from poking a hole in the fiberboard barrel. I put pipe insulation around the top of the barrel uh, to keep it more airtight and amazingly it works pretty good. This is the size of the hole to fit the cyclone to the barrel. Here are the wedges to prop up the barrel, snug against the top. This is the shelf that holds a cyclone. 